Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, girls and boys, you know what time it is. Wyatt, what time is it? It's time for the One Kids Club 252 <laughs> 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 That was too good. That was really good. Call us butter, because we're on a roll. How are you little boys and little girls doing today? We're so glad to see you, and we hope that you're having a great day. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whichever the case may be. Due to the glory of God and the technological ingenuity of some dude at Canon, here we are, and we're glad to be with you today. So everybody stand up, stand up, get ready, because it's time to sing a song. Singing your praises Can't stop, won't Why are you supposed to be singing with me, dude? Why? <laughs> Why? Can't stop, won't Because we enjoy singing Alright, boys and girls It is time for a little game we like to call Simon Says So little boys and little girls Here we go Are you ready? Touch your nose <gasps> Simon didn't say You only do what Simon says So let's try it again, you ready? Simon says touch your ear Simon says touch your knees. Simon says touch your nose. Touch your knees. <gasps> no, did I get you? You're only supposed to do what Simon says. Simon says touch your ears. Simon says touch your knees. Simon says touch your nose. Touch your ears. <gasps> I, I think I got you. You guys are doing so good. You remember that we play this game because it reminds us that we should always listen to God. And God is our creator and he loves us and he made you just the way that you are. Man, I love that. So, 
It's time for another song, and I think you're going to like this. This is one of our new ones, so you guys sing along with us. think of that huh what do you think of that one all right so boys and girls you know that we do a thing here at one church called missions and that is where we get to go tell the whole world that Jesus loves them just like he loves you and he loves me and so we are so excited you guys know we go all around all around the world telling people about Jesus and so we go to a place called Mozambique it's a country in Africa and we go to a place called Zambia it's another country in Africa and we go to this little island called Key Cocker which is in Belize which is in Central South America actually Central America but yeah and then we do missions here in the United States in Arizona and then we do missions right here in Conway and every time you hear the word missions, I want you boys and girls to just know that that means telling people about Jesus. Because that's what God has asked us to do, to tell everybody else that Jesus loves them. So let's pray for all of our missionaries. You pray with me. Dear Lord, we thank you for every one of our missionaries, for every one of the people, whether we know them or not, every person around the world who is telling other people about you, we pray that you would give them favor and grace. That you would give them physical protection and spiritual protection. Lord, we thank you for our missionaries in Mozambique, who are Isaac and Carol, and their kids and their family. We thank you for our missionaries in Zambia, who are Sanderson and Lewindo and their kids. God, we thank you for those who work with us in, in Belize, like Pastor Oscar and Pastor Lloyd. And, and uh, we thank you for those who work with us in Arizona. And God, we ask that every time we go to tell people about Jesus, that they would hear that you love them and that they would respond to that. We pray this in Jesus' name, amen. All right, so um, we started a thing last week where we started this thing about animals called jump flop no jump flap flop or hop so just go to that screen why jump flap flop or hop okay 
jump, flap, flop, or hop. So I'm going to, we're going to throw a picture up, and then you tell me if you think this animal jumps, flaps, flops, or hops, okay? All right, so the first one is, <gasps> those are dolphins. Woo, check them out. See them? Woo, what are they doing? They are flopping. Uh, that's very good. I, I think they're flipping. See, it's flipper. Dolphin is flipper. Yes, it is a <laughs> jump, flap, flop, or hop. Oh, I didn't say flip, did I? Well, then what do you think they're doing? I think they're flopping. Okay, I think they're flopping. And jumping. Okay, and jumping. Well, maybe they're doing flopping and hopping and, well, they're not hopping. Don't you have to have feet to hop? Yes. Okay, so they don't have feet, so they're either jumping or they're flopping. Or they're Probably flapping. not flapping, though. Okay, all right. Next one is. Jumping. Ooh, that is a big fish. That's a bass. What do you think the bass is doing? Probably flopping. Yeah. They flop probably. in the water. Yeah, okay. That's yeah. flopping. I, I, can, I can get one. That's a, ooh, ooh, it's a bunny rabbit. A bunny rabbit. Did you ever have a bunny rabbit growing up, Wyatt? My aunt did. Your aunt had a bunny rabbit? Yeah. Very good. We we had some rabbits, and we had rabbits when PJ and Savannah and Aubrey were really little too. Um, Did yeah. you like your rabbits? Pardon me. Did you like your rabbits? Well, of course we loved our rabbits. They were so very cuddly oh. and nice and, and sweet bunny rabbits. We sold them, right? Okay. That's cool. Um, so does the bunny rabbit jump, flop, flap, fl jump, flap, flop, or hop? It hops. It hops. A bunny hop. A bunny rabbit hops. Yes. I think you're right. All right, and then the last one is. Ooh, what is that? A kangaroo. That's a kangaroo. That's, That's a, kangaroo. a kangaroo right That's a, there. That's a kangaroo. He, look how big his feet are. He's got gargantuan feet. I mate. Yeah. Uh oh, well, I was doing a British and <laughs> jumped to the Australian. There you jumping, go. Okay. Jumping to Australian. Jum uh, jumping. jumping. To That's what he does. <laughs> he jumps. Right? Yes. So the and kangaroo kicks. jumps. I guess he got kind of say he hops, but I think he jumps. You know how they kick? I do know they kick. You know when they kick, boys and girls, they lean back on the really strong tail and they kick like that. It's crazy. Yeah, it is crazy. It's impressive. It would probably be impressive to watch unless you're watching it up close. Yeah, that, that yeah, would yeah, suck. Yeah, you know what I mean? I'd still be impressed. Yeah, it yeah, just... you'd be. Yes, you would. You would be <laughs> impressed. <laughs> <laughs> ah, ha, ha. You get it? You get it? The funny. Thing. I got it. I got it. That's How about funny. that? Okay. That's a good one. All right, boys and girls, um, let's do the memory verse. Let's, do, let's jump around and do the memory verse. The memory verse, is, this is the last time for this month that we're doing it. Next month, we will have another one. But this month's memory verse is Ephesians 4.32. Ephesians 4.32. Be kind and compassionate. Be kind and compassionate. To one another. To one another. Forgiving each other. Forgiving each other. Just as in Christ. Just as in Christ. God forgave you. God forgave you. Oh, that is so good, boys and girls. I am so proud of you. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to sing a song, and then when we're done with the song, you sit down and you watch today's video. It is a good one. You're going to like it. This is my faith, this is my focus All of my days, I know where my hope is I live it loud, I shout the chorus Because I know, oh, you're always for us And even when it's hard for me to see, to see I will trust in you, I will believe, believe And even when it's hard for me to see, to see I will trust in you, I will believe and keep on looking, looking, looking to you For where I'm going, knowing you go there too I'll keep on looking, looking, looking to you I'll fix my eyes on you This is my face 
This is my focus All of my days I know where my hope is I live it like I shot the chorus Because I know Oh, you're always for us And even when it's hard for me to see To see I will trust in you I will believe, believe And even when it's hard for me to see To see I will trust in you I will believe And keep on looking, looking, looking to you For where I'm going, knowing you go there too I'll keep on looking, looking, looking to you I'll fix my, I'll fix my eyes, eyes on you must have blew through the clubhouse because all of our pictures fell off the walls. What am I going to do? What a mess. How am I going to clean all of this up? It's too big of a job for me. Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hello, Lucy. Who? Who? You look like you are feeling blue. Hi, Ollie. I sure am. The wind knocked all of my pictures off the walls. There's no way I can clean them all back up. That is a big mess. It's true. But there is something you can do. Just listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Hola, friends! Hello! I'm Luis, the handyman. Good to see you. I'm just fixing this radio for my aunt, Marisol. It's been broken for a while, so I offered to help fix it for her. That reminds me of a story. Do you want to help me build it? <laughs> Great! Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer! Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down now. Now, we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. Okay, so today's true story from the Bible is about a woman named Tabitha. Tabitha loved God and helped people by making them clothes which was good because lots of people needed help. There you go, guys. 
Wow, great job, Tabitha. <laughs> you helped a lot of people. Did you know God made you and me to help people too? That's right. Whether you're a grown-up or a kid, you can help. Even if you can't sew like Tabitha, do you think God could use a kid like you to help others? <laughs> of course, yes. Let's think of things you can do to help. Hmm, you can draw someone a picture to make them smile. You can play toys with your little sister or cousins or neighbors. You can help clean up after dinner. You can give someone a hug and tell them you love them. You can help in so many ways, no matter how old you are. God made you to help. Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who made you? God made me. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who made you? God made me. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. So there's your story. It's all true. No matter who you are, you can help too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? What a great story. God made everyone to help. No matter how old we are, we can help. That means you can help and I can help. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Good! Even though I am small, I can do this big job and pick the pictures up and hang them back up. Can I take one last picture of you? This time, give a thumbs up for being a happy helper. Are you ready? Say cheese! Awesome! I'll see you guys later. Bye! There it is. How about that, boys and girls? I love that, that you and I are made by God. We're made in His image. He made us and He knows us, but He did that so that we could help others. God wants us to be able to help other people. You can help your mom and your dad and your little brother and little sister, and we can help our neighbors. And so God made us to not just help them, but to help them because we love them. Well, let's pray. Lord, we thank you for this day, and we thank you for the truth that you love us and that you help us, and that you allow us to help other people. Help us to help others today. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, that's it. Uh, Mr. Paul, we love you all, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.